So before I begin the honorary degrees, I am delighted this morning to introduce a new award, the Global Citizens Award. We have long been thinking about a Middlebury Award, one which would give, be given to someone who embodies the best of Middlebury values, integrity, rigor, connectedness, compassion, openness. And in the busyness of being the vibrant community that we are, we did not have the time or the occasion to make it happen. And then in July of last year, we were all riveted by the international cave rescue near Chiang Rai, Thailand, which involved a monumental international collaborative effort to free young soccer players, and many of them were from the Bang Wang Pan School in Mai Se near Chiang Rai, Thailand. At the quiet, intense center of that rescue was a 13-year-old young man, Adun Sam On, who, even though he himself was suffering intensely, offered to act as interpreter with the divers, using English, Thai, and Chinese to do so. Early in his life, Adun Sam On fell in love with languages, speaking Wa with his family, learning Thai, Burmese, and English with his pastor, and Chinese with his soccer buddies. He used this language ability to save lives, turning hardship into human connection and knowing that compassion, cross-cultural understanding, and impactful change go hand in hand. We could think of no better recipient of the Global Citizens Award than this young man. He is a mid-kid through and through. We dreamt of the remote chance that we could bring him here to meet us. And we were so excited to learn a few weeks ago that Adun's visa had been approved. It is with profound joy that we welcome Adun Samon as he joins us here at Middlebury at the ripe old age of 14 with the director of his school, Mr. Ponawit Tespurin, and several of his teachers and administrators. I met Adun on Friday and have been honored to spend time with him and his teachers. And when I asked him what motivated him in life, he said, to keep learning and to keep trying. I am also delighted to announce that Middlebury will be sending two interns to teach English at the Ban Wang Pan School this summer, inaugurating a partnership between our two schools, which we hope will last well into the future. At this time, I would like to ask Patrick Ganey to please escort Adun Sam On, Mr. Punawit Thesporin, and teachers Chitwilawan Kumala, Budkau and Pijan, as well as their student translators to the center stage. Adun Saman, you captured the hearts of the world simply by being who you are, intelligent, compassionate, communicative, expressive, and capable. You have never been a stranger to challenging circumstances. As a young child, your parents brought you from your home in a dangerous territory in Myanmar to Thailand in order to give you access to schooling and a more hopeful future. In your new school, you joined the 20% of students who were stateless and half who were ethnic minorities. You embraced your challenges and excelled as a student and as an athlete. You studied languages, including Mandarin, Burmese, and English. Then, in the summer of 2018, you and your soccer teammates and your coach became trapped in a flooded cave in northern Thailand. For more than two weeks, your fate was uncertain until a team of British divers discovered you and your group deep inside the Tom Luang Cave. 
your ability to communicate with your rescuers in English when they found you, and your interpretation throughout the rescue was invaluable. Your extensive language skills, your efficiency, your concern first and foremost for the well-being of others, and your unflagging politeness speak to the extraordinary young man and global citizen that you are. In short, Adun Samon, you embody so many of the values that Middlebury tries to advance in the world. It is therefore my privilege and honor to present to you the first Middlebury Global Citizens Award. We will give this award annually to a person who, through selfless and compassion and commitment to open and generous communication, is able to change the world in service to others. May those recipients who follow you be inspired by your courage and carry forth your spirit. As we celebrate more than two centuries of ties between the college and the world, it is therefore my privilege to confer upon you with this medal, the Global Citizens Award, in recognition of your distinguished contributions to the global community. Congratulations. Let us now begin the presentation of the honorary degrees. I would like to invite Middlebury trustee Kathy Lee and Professor Kevin Moss to come forward to present Judith Human for her honorary degree. <laughs> 